Hi, this is Dr. Rod at 17 Street Chiropractic one more time. Today is night time, so it's a little bit darker over here. Um, I'd like to talk to you today a little bit about cortisone shots. Um, they're prescribed a lot lately by medical doctors. Usually when people have some sort of a strain, sprain, uh, muscle pain, low back pain, any kind of pain, really joint pain, um, they prescribe a cortisone shot. Uh, a lot of people don't know what it is and how that affects you and uh, the side effects of uh, actually getting a cortisone shot. So I'd like to explain to you what goes on when you do that. But before that, um, I have to get back a little bit and talk about uh, inflammation, okay? So you can understand what a cortisone shot does to you. So inflammation is a normal response of your body to injury or infection. Okay. It's actually your natural body response and it starts the healing process. Okay. So the heat that you feel when you, something is inflaming your body is your body heating up the area so there is more blood flow going to the area. Okay. The tightness that you feel, the muscles going tight like this, is the body uh, tightening up the muscles so any impact, any, anything else going on in that area will be protected. So it's tight like this. So if there was any sort of trauma, the area will be protected. So what it does is actually speeds up the healing. The heat also speeds up the healing and actually makes the area starts the healing process and starts to make it better. Now, um, too much inflammation is not good, okay? Because um, also with inflammation, because of the increased blood supply, there is increased fluid in the area because of the blood, okay? The fluid can also expand and act, actually cause more injury to the area than the initial injury because it expands and breaks tissues and all kinds of things, okay? But as long as the inflammation is controlled, is a good thing, is the healing process of the body, okay? so. Let's talk a little bit about cortisone shots. A lot of people get it, especially for low back pain. Whenever you have a disc uh, problem or a nerve that you feel like it's pinched or you did something, you go to a medical doctor, they prescribe you a uh, cortisone shot. So what is a cortisone shot? Um, cortisone shot is a very powerful anti-inflammatory. Okay? It kills inflammation. Okay? Um, so you can start thinking about what I just told you and what we did. So, if you have a problem in your body and um, you do a cortisone shot, you kill the inflammation. So, if the problem was there and was being taken care of by the inflammation, uh, start the healing process, um, it's gonna stop. So the problem is gonna still be there and it's not gonna heal anymore because the inflammation has been killed or diminished a lot, okay? Um, a lot of people want a quick fix. Uh, they are in pain because nobody wants to be in pain. It's discomfort. It uh, it's, doesn't feel good. You can't move right. So what they do is they go to the doctor and they give you uh, the cortisone shot. Kills the inflammation. Kills the pain. You feel good. You can move. But the problem that it's causing is that it's not fixing the problem that you're having. It's just killing the inflammation, which is the healing process. And as I said again, as long as it's not out of control, um, there's not a whole lot of swelling, there's not a whole lot of pain, uh, it's okay because it's actually healing that part of the body. It's the body knows what it's doing and it's actually healing that um, part of the body, okay? So that's problem number one with uh, a cortisone shot. Second thing about cortisone shots, cortisones are steroids, okay? Steroids are um, chemicals that your body made and is made out of fat that controls all kinds of uh, uh, functions in your body and the body produces that naturally um, at a very um, regulated amount okay so whenever you're injecting um, steroids in your body doesn't matter what kind you're gonna have an effect from it whenever you see um, uh, bodybuilders and uh, uh, recently um, the biker uh, Lance Armstrong, you know, they're taking steroids to enhance their performance. Um, it, it makes big changes to your body and it's not all positive, okay? And uh, that's what we're going to talk about here. Cortisone um, actually can cause many things, okay? First one is weight gain, 
okay, which is, uh, considering it's not really that much of a big deal, okay. But very, very, very important is that cortisone, whenever injected in that area, actually causes all the tissue around it to be weakened, okay. So ligaments, tendons, disc, muscles, they are weak, okay. So let's look at your spine over here. Let's say you have a disc that is a problem over here, okay. You inject the cortisone shot to kill that inflammation, to kill the pain so you can move better, okay. So one, not only you killed the healing process that was going on right there, but you weakened this area so you can actually re-injure that and make it a lot worse, okay. Second thing is that a cortisone shot can actually cause um, osteopenia and arthritis and osteoporosis. It weakens the muscle, it corrodes, sorry, weakens and corrodes the bone, okay? So right away, it's, it feels great, okay? Because whatever pain you had, feels good, it's gone, okay, you feel good, but it corrodes your bone. So the long-term side effect is that area is gonna get worse just because your bone is now starting to be corroded. It's kind of like an acid to that area, okay? Again, it causes osteopenia, arthritis, osteoporosis, okay? The, uh, there are studies out there that uh, say that nobody should ever take a cortisone shot, okay? Um, maybe one in their lifetime. And today is prescribed like, as I said, it's just a cookie, you know? Oh, you're in the doctor, you're in pain, here's a cookie or here's a cortisone shot, like with no, um, thought about how that is going to affect you in the future. Um, it can be very debilitating, okay? It can cause, uh, as I said, arthritis, which you maybe have to cause fusion to your spine, um, replacement of joints if it's in the knee or in the hip. So what I'm trying to say is stay away from cortisone shots as much as possible, okay? Uh, especially for low back pain, chiropractic treatment has been shown or adjustments in general has been shown, manipulative treatments have been shown to be the most effective form of actually resolving the problem. You're not just killing the symptoms, but will also resolve the problems. It might not be something immediate like a cortisone shot that will take the pain right away, okay? It's going to take up uh, some time and it's going to require some effort and uh, a few continuing visits um, so you can get that resolved. Okay, it may take a month, it may take a month and a half um, with visits maybe three times a week. Okay, uh, but once you're, you're done, you're out of pain, you're mostly out of pain, in most cases you're totally out of pain, and the problem has actually been corrected. Okay, so think about it uh, before uh, doing cortisone shots again, and uh, think about your future. Okay, it's not just the now, the present, but how are you going to be in 10, 15, 20, 30 years from now? Okay, do you want to deal with uh, surgery and fusions and replacement of joints? Um, that's totally up to you. It's always best to try um, the most invasive treatment first, which is chiropractic. And then if that doesn't work, then you go somewhere else. Okay. Um, again, thank you so much for watching. I hope this has been uh, educational. And um, I hope you come see us at 17th Street Chiropractic over here in San Francisco, 3705 17th Street. Thank you so much.